Um, let's get this uh, merchant question out of the way. Merchant! Oh, oh what? What is, what is it, stranger? What's the matter? You got a question, merchant? Oh, a question. Oh, I love these. Really? There you go. Oh, no, no eggs. Stop frying eggs at me. What is this? It's the vicious cycle of the merchant question. I come on. Ah, how's it going, stranger? What's the matter? And then I go in to answer the question. It's like, oh, no, people are scaring me. People are throwing eggs at me. Stop it. Anyway, just read the question, merchant. You'll just have to power through. All right, stranger. I'm ready. Hey, merchant. I bet you heard many tales and stories, huh? Most of them probably weren't true and didn't end up actually leading to any adventures. Oi! I've been on many adventures, thank you very much. However, those that did, which one do you think is the greatest one? I heard something about blooms recently. Wonder if you know anything about that? Uh, about it as well. Oh yes, the tragic tale of the blooms, yes. I was there when the whole war began, you know? It's terrible. I'm actually the major supplier to the <laughs> monkey <laughs> army, right? Because those balloons, those bastard balloons, oh, they're nasty. They are <laughs> trickery. They they uh, employ. They do. You know the the monkeys in <laughs> the balloons. They used to live in harmony. Harmony. That everything changed when they attacked, right? And they attacked me as well. Out of the blue, they came in and stopped trying to mug me, the bastards. But that's when Quincy and the gang came in to save me. Oh, it was a close one, it was. Ever since then, I've been working with the monkeys to destroy the dreaded balloon scum. Still don't know to this day why they do it. Maybe one day I can tell you some more, some more stories about that. Stranger! What's the man merchant? Bloody hell. I was taking a drink while I was talking. That was really stupid. That is really stupid. You just got drink all over my table. Mm -hmm. Get out! Ah! Geraldo is hotter. I think uh, Geraldo is probably one of Merchant's rivals, you know. Chat, I've been a, a little bit busy off screen. Uh, as you can see, I have 41 cat capsules. Um, I've been grinding these, and you probably know why. I, I want to get the fish. <laughs> oh, fuck. <laughs> we want to use tray for tickets. So we get what? Like two, three tickets out of that, which is nice, I guess. And then we use all of these. Very nice. <laughs> Is Fish on most upgraded? Nah, he's one behind um, one behind the, the Goliath. And uh, Gross is still doing pretty bad. Even a Razor. Would have been nice to get more tanks. No, our Fish. Our Fish is jacked. He's ready to kill. 4,000 user rank. Yeah, we've done it. And you can actually see it as well because I've shrunk the, um, the code blocker. But yes, we are now officially... Over 4k on the user rank. What is our super mega reward for reaching such a milestone? That's actually really good. <laughs> lucky seven fish. Yeah, we got lucky seven tickets. Maybe this will be enough, Jet. Jet, we're going to be put into the test. Is seven the lucky number it says it is? Right, let's find out. It's begin. Can we finally get our hands on a brainwashed fish? Let's find out. <laughs> Yeah, you know what? Fuck it. <laughs> Let's use them. All right, here we go. Number two is the Murkat, who we really need to get round to true forming, and I don't think we actually have yet. Can we get the brainwash, please? We need him. We need fi- Ah, oh, it's the toaster. Number four. Can we get number four lucky? Lucky number four? No, no, not lucky number four, but I do like Welter White. Can we get the fish, please? I need him. No, it's the thief. But it's the nerd. This is it. This is like our last chance. Our last chance at the goon. Until what? Like Halloween? Come on, please. Let's go. Give me the fish. Power. Get him. Get him. Yes. Fuck. <laughs> Might as well waste cat food. I'm not doing that. You may be very lucky with Ubers, but you don't get what you actually want. That is, ex that is so true. Like, that is literally just the story of my life, Ludo. What is that? Is that a poll? You want me to do singles? Chat, please, no. This is bad. Are you sure? That's a bad idea, right? Story of Legends crowns, please. You get brainwashed unit. It will 100% be axed because that's just how it was. Yeah, that's another point that we didn't realize, chat. We could end up getting a brainwash that isn't the fish. There's two others that we could get. Chat, I'm going to think about it. I'm going to think about it extremely hard. 
Anyway, um, I really just want to first get something out of the way. Is that we have our first uh, superior enigma stage, which I wanted to show off today. Um, we get food for this, don't we? Oh, bloody hell, it's a lot. Hint, a bit of everything, including metal. Oh, okay, so it's like a, a you know, like an all-round stage, okay. Uh, uh, what's the trick room? Number two, normal and super rare. Okay, uh, so I guess for anti-dark, we're forced to use the heavy assault kit. Manix is super, yes, so I can't use these. Not allowed to use the Manix. Uh, right, we're gonna go in here, I think. Uh, we're gonna begin. Uh, okay, so let's get to level eight. We are ready. I think I wait, spawn a Matarasu first, and then we just like play from there. Uh, it's a dark elephant. Oh, and I forgot to bring metal. Okay, uh, that is a problem. I have fish. Fish has, or at least little fish has what, like a 5% chance to crit? So uh, we might be okay. There's a lot of metal though. Uh, I might die here because of these metals. Oh, come on, please. No. <laughs> Wait. Oh, I could have fired the laser. Uh, I did bring a critter. I completely forgot. And I, w I was told by Mudkip that there was one, but I, I forgot. I didn't see any floating, so we could get rid of you. And honestly, I don't think that stage was really that bad, if I'm honest. It's just a metal, but I, I got killed by them because I didn't have my crits. It's like, we should be okay. There's another crit. I don't know if it actually killed anything. Oh, that one did. Uh, let's send all the goons. Let's just send everyone. I think this is hopefully where we can recover. You see, we still haven't killed all of these bloody metal enemies. I'm just still getting unlucky again. It's just, it's the metal. It's just the metal. I hate metal. I hate metal so, and there's a bun bun. Oh my God. Man, I hate zombies. No, I hate metal. Metal's the worst enemy type in the entire game. It's just gamber. Uh, it's like, I do enough gamber as it is. That's why metal is the uh, shittiest straight design. I agree, you know, it's just, it's just scuffed. I, I, I think I have to bring Hayabusa. If he hits uh, a crit, it's area. So like he'll be able to kill like a lot of things, and I think that's more useful than big cheese. And then I replace like space major. I'll keep Catasaurus like just in case. And instead of that, I will bring uh, Catalyte. Come on, we gotta do this, please. I just need Hayabusa to do his job. Then again, there's still a chance that he won't. That's the annoying thing. It's like I could still get like so freaking unlucky and like Hayabusa just doesn't land a single crit. But, yeah, there's enough there. There's enough dojis for them to start sweeping. So let's send him out now. Let's send the goon. Oh! That's what I'm talking about. That's the way. Look at that. That's what we need. Okay, now I need Hayabusa to do it again. Thank you. That is a double crit right there. But now we got Bun Bun. We got a crit on the metal again. But we're getting pushed back. High boost is almost dead, I reckon. Oh! Oh, that's good! That was a nice little crit there. There's still more metal. Amaterasu is dead. Which is actually really bad. We, we, we're probably still dead here. We can't do this. No. Yeah! Alright, let's do this. But now I'm allowed to use my actual, like, goons. Ah, uh, th this ought to work. Right, this is the last time I'm attempting this. This is actually ridiculous. Come on, Bazzy. Just, like, two-shot this guy, please. Please, just take him out. He's just so annoying. And these metals, please, Hayabusa. Kill the metals. Go! Amaterasu's dead. Ken is dead as well, but we took out the elephant. Oh, that was a good hit. That was solid. That was very nice. And we got a big, um, we got a savage blow from, um, Housewife as well. But, uh, it hit metal, so it didn't actually do anything. Bazzy's dead. I think we're dead again, chat. Fire the laser. Don't give up until it's over. Don't give up until it's over. Just concentrate. Concentrate. Right, just focus. Go, 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 go. Go, go, go. Go, go. Yes, yes, yes. Never give up. Don't give up until it's over. I hated that. We better get something bloody good for this. I better get a super duper rare like artifact. Right, that will that will unlock like the super god. Phew. Super god unit. Oh, you've got to be for real. Is that what I get? That's it. 
That's that all of that. All of that for one of these. What the fuck? Sad you didn't get destroyed by Bun Bun Bun's random 5% chance of wipe. I would literally have ripped out my PC from the wall and thrown it across the room. Crack Right, we're going to be doing something nicer now. Mudkip, should we do a pal? Should we uh, select some things that uh, people want me to do? It's the lucky sickness to get like a... What do we get from this? The koi cat? Would you like to see with a koi cat? Because isn't koi cat a fish? Is that a type of fish that we can get? This is disgusting. Oh, that's terrible. Oh, I'm not doing that. Dumb boss, what are we doing? Did you seriously put that on there, Mudkip? Why did you put that? <laughs> did that better not go through? I might as well just go on the reign of Tyrant now. It's probably going to win, you know. <laughs> Wouldn't it be so funny if we made Dad to do something that he has literally no fucking chance of beating? Wait, what the hell? Why is the stage even available to be played before finishing Story of Legends? Are we discovering new things today, chat? I guess, like, they made it available to you because it's like, well, just in case, like, some, like, little Timmy when he's playing Battle Cats, let's fucking scar him for life. Okay, so we need to bring with us Cow Princess. Oh, we're, we're off to a great start, chat. Uh, Major League, which is a super rare. Surely, Major League will be able to get a home run on the first hit and insta-fucking kill the boss. Surely. Cow Princess, I believe, will probably one-shot it. This boss has 4.6 million HP, by the way. Nothing that the Cow Princess can't handle, innit? Okay, I think that's a good setup, chat. We're ready. I think we're ready to do this. Oh, we're in the Hall of Origin. Oh, that looks scary. Okay. Well, it looks like Arceus is going to beat the shit out of us, chat. Are we going to fight Arceus, the god of, of life as we know it? Oh, there's a new enemy. Is that new? There's an angel man. Oh, I rammed him with the Shinkalion. Let's send out a fish man so we don't, like, immediately die. Ah! Oh, hello. There's a Brillo zombie. Oh, yeah, look, his, his body parts all, like, disintegrate into pieces. Look at that. Oh. oh, what happened to me? Everyone just fucking died. Oh, I've been poisoned. Was that poison? I should stop spawning cow princess. Oh, I think we're dead. <laughs> well, I guess we'll never find out what the enemy is. We saw something new, though. We saw that. Oh. That's what that one sounds like. It's really high pitched, and then it just like goes deep because he's dead. It's like Brillo! Oh. That boss was cool. Yeah, it was really entertaining, wasn't it? Bring courier, and you might see the boss. The thing is, right? I'm gonna be real with you. I'm kind of glad we didn't see the boss. I kind of want to attempt this when we have a chance, and like react to the boss, and like ah, it's the guy, and then we beat him. Like ha ha. Otherwise, like, when I when I finally get to this part again, and it's like, all right, here we go. Oh, it's that guy I've seen before. Well, let's see if we can beat him. Like, it's not going to be as exhilarating and entertaining. I'm like, whoa! Meet the Zwallow! He has a uh, toxic and does a specific percentage of damage and has lower HP, but revive. But in my opinion, he does not get annoying. You know what, chat? You picked something that you wanted to do, and it was bollocks. Right now, it's my turn to pick something that I want to do, and I want to get the fish. Yes, love is sickness, isn't it? Yes, vile. Oh, I feel terrible that I'm love. Oh, I'm going to bother me. Yes. You know what, chat? Let's bring someone new today. Let's bring the swordsman cat. Surely this cat is going to yes. be better than courier. While we're at it, yes. let's see what the swordsman cat looks like at level 10, chat. Bada bing, bada boom. <laughs> Whoa! The Sword Master Cat! Has he got the Master Sword? He looks like he's got two! Uh, the Sword Master Cat mastered the art of the drill wielding. Also can use magic. Scary combination. Flame Swords do massive damage to red enemies. Is he gonna get free swords like Zoro? Triform looks cool, but it's outclassed by Courier. Well, at least it looks cool. I mean, I might as well, like, true form it to see, like, what it looks like eventually. Go, get him! Slash him! Oh, yes! Look at that fire sword ability. That is so cool. I mean, like, these are super weak enemies, so, like, chances... Oh! What'd he do to him? Save him, giraffe cat, just like you saved the fish. Yes, get him. Oh, we got an enemy. But a master swordsman cat should be able to take care of him. Never mind. <laughs> He's already dead. 
前はもう死んでる。何 Half the things in this game can be summed up as outclassed by Sanzo slash Guria, but some are still decent units. I'm guessing this guy isn't a decent unit and is outclassed. Because like, I remember when we got him, people were saying, like, oh yeah, he's like absolutely terrible. Do not use him.、Uh, let's send the Shinkalion. He's really fucking quick. I can see why a lot of people were saying that Shinkalion is like really good. Then again, he takes. Bloody forever to attack. Look at that. He's waiting for the passengers. Oh, is he waiting to pick up some passengers? All aboard! Actually, a, a Shin Kellyan prob probably wouldn't make that noise, wouldn't it? Now, do the Maglav TF is one of the fastest cats in the game, so yes. So it's one of the fastest. So not the fastest, but it's up there. So we, we got Fishman. A fishman could be upgraded with talent. I don't know if he's the fastest or it's something else. But then again, I think people told me not to upgrade、uh, fishman's、uh, speed talents. The reason for not wanting fishman's speed talent levels is because how speed affects range in a weird way. Fishman case, the faster he is, the harder it will be for him to safely hit bun bun variants. Is that because, like, when you get a knockback on him, like. The characters can run past them while they're in a knockback phase, is that why? Due to speed, they clip into the range of enemies, which can be so annoying. Thing is, I haven't. I don't know if I've even encountered that issue, or. Like, the only issue I've encountered is him, like, running through an enemy that's, like, been knocked back. So, like, I guess eventually, maybe I'll, like, realize when it actually happens to me what that means. Pretty much, a unit will move equal to, I think, half their speed stat in pixels each frame. Instead of being a continuous movement, the game treats it as sort of a teleport. So, with super high speeds, he will just clip into Bun Bun's range and get smacked. Right. So, you keep him slow enough so that doesn't happen. I see, I see. Alright, is this the last one? There's a bit more here. Let's just be friends. What is actually happening here? Liking love. No more duck face. Okay. Read but no reply. Online dating. Vlogs on Facebook. Work or me. Let's just be friends. I should have been reading these. <laughs> It's really funny. It's also units with one speed. Wasn't there like the, the cat that's like, that doesn't move at all? Now don't mention the forbidden cat. Say goodbye to your account. Do I get banned for it? Is it that? Is it just like how Ninja Kiwi, like, but they stop people from talking about the balloon chipper? Is it like that? The Forsaken Cat. Anyone who dares speak its name shall be banned in three days. Joy your time left while it lasts. Never give up. Let's be friends. Don't give up unless they actually make it 100% clear to you to stop what you're doing because let's not harass people, okay? Maybe. Look, the map is on this one. Right, it's the ocean, and then we got this thing which has a fish on it. There's plenty of fish in the sea. Maybe it's like, well, you didn't have any luck with that person. Find someone else. Don't give up! Everyone deserves love, chat. Maybe we could do a manic. Yeah, we could do a manic. Manic macho links? We could do that. We could do a poll, maybe, but a legitimate one. Please, nothing silly, my kid. Because if there's something silly, people will vote for it. It's just a ha ha troll. <laughs> We're gonna troll Radu today. <laughs> We should do Rolling Dead. I'm curious about Rolling Dead. Is that even possible for me? Maybe it is. And there we go. Here's our drop award. Rare Cat, Koi Cat received. Activated in the upgrade menu. Where are you, Koi Cat? Oh, look, it's a little guy with a spinny thing on his back. Koi Cat, distant relative of the fish cat. A good long distance attacker, strong against red enemies. I said, it's. Oh, that's kind of boring. He's got arms, though. He's lost his back legs, but he has arms now, and there's a child on his back for some reason. So we've gone from a koi to. A gross koi cat with a child on its back. So, what? Wait, is it. Chat, I have a funny feeling I might not like this. So it's going to be really creepy, isn't it? Oh my god. <laughs> At least the spindy doodle up here looks cool.、Uh, gross Koi Cat. Koi Cat and Gross Cat's distant cousin. Still wondering if it is Gross or Koi. It's the fish cat's distant cousin. We got Jeremy Clarkson on today. Gross Manic. Yes, I can only attempt it one or clear it one time. 
Now, there, I don't know if you have it or not, but I recommend Octopus Cat. We do. I imagine the reason why you're recommending that uh, is because there's going to be wave units here. Plane Cat is Robo. I swear to God, what is that? Rarity restriction, normal and super rare. Okay. What is it with you guys and doing, like, normal and super rare? So that means I can't actually bring a wave blocker. Tech up combos are helpful. I suppose what we could do is get... Because these... Well, that's super rare. I can't I can't use this one. But then again, like, in, in restriction stages, you're still technically allowed to bring any cat you want for cat combos. It's just that you can't spawn it. But I worry that I'm accidentally going to spawn Rocat. And then people are going to be like, oh, you got SD now, game over. Tack up. Let the Manic Macho hit your base. Then use Holy Valkyrie and Behemoth. Easy win. Is it that easy? Okay. Right, I'm going to do a prediction. There we go, chat. Predict away. That should be cool for Nado to do certain stages without power creep units. Yeah, I mean, it'll be interesting, you know, to see if I can win. And it me to, like, maybe appreciate some of the older, older cats, older methods. I'm all about that. That's fine. Of course, I will have fun and use, like, power creep strats as well. Like, I, I like to keep things fresh and do different things, you know? Oh! Whoa! Someone dipped their feet in ink? What is that? All right, hello. There's a squirrel here to say hello to me. Well, I'm... <laughs> so I'm guessing you, you spawn Valkyrie so you can freeze him? Like, Valkyrie doesn't always freeze, that's the thing. Or maybe I shouldn't- Oh, bloody hell! Alright, you're gonna hit my base? Alright, here we go! Get him! Get him, guys! They spawn you! Fire the cannon! Send out couriers as well, do some extra damage. Oh god, that looks scary. They spawn Parises. Hopefully, Behemoth survives, and we get some freezes. Oh! Oh, Behemoth is dead! Everyone's dead! Okay, that was bad. Oh, Lord. Oh, Jesus Christ. We killed one of them, though. <laughs> he stood too close to the enemies. So what did I actually do wrong there? People were saying that I mistimed it. Spawn by Behemoth right as the squirrel went in front of MML. Oh. All right, chat. Can I beat Manic Gross first try? Congratulations to the non-believers. You win. You didn't even gamble anything as well. Short break after this stage? Yeah, I think I need one. Oh no, Burlige. Burlige. <laughs> Burlige died. All right, get him. But yeah, like with um with the Octo Cat, this yeah this stage is pretty free. <laughs> that was fucking stupid. That's the thing though, like. Oh yeah. To, on the defense of whoever submitted the uh, the Enchantress Cat restriction. At least that was interesting and, like, there was a little bit of suspense. Like, if we had just done it with Octo, look how, like, boring that was. <laughs> Borlicare Cat can't protect Octo as they have the same range. You'd want a Razor to actually protect Octo. They have the same range? Okay, I'm learning new things about Borlicare. All right, here we go. Time to obtain our new friend, the Manic Macho Legs. Oh, it's actually Macho Legs. Because this is Macho Leg. It's a mistranslation. Manic Macho Legs, uh, Frenzy has enhanced the beauty of his legs and the power of his long distance attacks even more. Popularity is down though. I will say, well, I think this looks better. Just because the pattern looks nicer, here it's just like, it's shorter, there's less of it. But they've gotten less crates as they've evolved, which is kind of weird. No damage buff, it's just wave level up and I think health. Oh, okay. That's still really good though. It was the rolling dead, some people were saying. We got, like, is this... I'm guessing this is for, like, zombie. We've attempted this before. We got wrecked. And we get cheerleader cat. We should probably do this, right? Main units here are gardener and boxer. So gardener is actually useful. So I should bring gardener with me for the freeze. You know what? That's probably... This is an okay loadout. I think we can do it with this. Like, we've leveled up enough now. Like, we should be fine. So... Already, I'm starting to see this guy get affected by a lot of things straight away. Which is really good to see. Honestly, like, so far, so good. <laughs> just stuck. It's like, help, I'm being bullied. Bobby, mommy, I'm fucking dead. I was bullied to death. Our anti-zombies are, like, actually, like, stupid good. Damn. I really want to true form this guy. He's my favorite. I love him. Really. <laughs> Treasure Radar plus uh, some CPUs to get 
the reward. Drop reward and super rare cat cheerleader camp received. Activate it in the upgrade menu. We got the elusive cheerleader camp. Oh, look! Oh! Oh, that's lovely! Oh, look at him! Cheerleader cat! Oh, chat, they're so cute! Cheerleader cat leaping about on the football field. Her youthful songs fill the battle cats with determination. 100% chance of a critical attack! Go, 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 go! Go, 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 go! I need cheerleader kit! Go, 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 go! All the way! All the fucking way! Up we go now! What's your second form? Woo! It's Waitress Cat! Yes! Going all in! I don't give a flying fuck! You are level 30 now! Thank you so much for 100% crit! I will take that! Waitress Cat, the real world called, but her enthusiasm remains. Her speedy service fills the cats with determination. 100% chance to critical. <laughs> she got a lovely strawberry cake, cake as well. Uh, make sure you give that to Kirby and you don't steal it. Otherwise, Kirby will go on a murderous rampage to murder everyone in his path to get his strawberry cake back. Introducing cheerleader, 100% chance to critical, single target attack with enough damage to two or three shot most of the tough metals. The downside, long cooldown and TPA, so she must be guarded well. So she has a low attack right, I see. That makes sense. That makes a lot of sense. Her animation's incredible. Should we try out our new friend, chat? Should we try Sweet Irony? Let's use our new friend. I actually have an anti-metal team set up already. Let's get our waitress cat. Does she have a combo? Looks like it. Oh, it's with the toaster! Cat can not recharge up small. That's right, I guess. I don't think the toaster's gonna be... Yeah, oh, fuck it. This is gonna be easy. I'm bringing toaster with me. Oh, there's Michelangelo. Might knock back metal enemies. Use Moneco and Craze Moneco for the combo of critical chance increase M. I could do that, but I'm doing the funny. Uh, I'm gonna bring Michelangelo cat instead. <laughs> That might actually screw you over. You think so? Michelangelo is gonna carry us. Just you watch. Michelangelo when it makes waitress miss her attack. Oh. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Michelangelo! Alright, they'll work hand in hand together. Just you watch, right? I'm gonna save waitress, right? So we can have, like, enough of, like, stuff at the front lines. Whoa! Alright, here we go. Here they are. Bloody hell, they look sick! Let's go! Oh, I can already hit the hear the crits already. Yes, Michelangelo, I believe in you. Oh, <laughs> look how good he is. He's keeping them at bay, like nothing is going to be able to get through. Look at him! Oh yes! Oh yes! Just like the commercial. Come, lads, fuck him up! Yes! Oh, easy. Michelangelo Kerry, let's go! Right, is it my turn to like go into chat now? Like, <laughs> I was right, you were wrong! Feeling good! <laughs> Here we go, drop rewards earned. Rare cat, hoot cat, recede. Activate it in the upgrade menu. Lovely. We got the hoop cat. Ooh, little, just like the crisps. Hoop cat. Yes! Uh, I'm gonna just upgrade hoop to level 10 and then we'll read both of their descriptions. Let's have a look, shall we? What does the hoop cat turn into? Woo! It turns into the show off cat. Oh, a wise guy, eh? You think all good, huh, punk? Hoop cat start again a bit pud pudgy. Pudgy? That's to say that they're fat, right? So he took up hula hooping as exercise. Might freeze metal enemies. Yes. And then next we have the show off cat. Started out hooping to preserve his figure, but his figure changed in an unexpected way. My freeze metal enemies. So he's showing off now because now he's like hula hooping up free at once. Oh, what a show off. Bitter irony. Yeah, look, it looks a bit harder. Look at that. So should we do this next since it looks like I have a pretty good chance of doing it? Uh, so what I can do, since there's no restrictions, I can bring it along with me since it's dark. We can snipe those dark units with uh, Canna, which would be ni very nice. I will sadly get rid of Michelangelo. It makes me sad to do that. How about a first try Gamma? I think so, yes. Since this is going to be the last one. Are we feeling up to some hula hooping? Already spinning them? They broke sadly. Prediction up, fellas. Go, go, go. But I think what we do is start stocking up on some goons. Maybe even get Kenner out now as well. 
so she can take out this uh, Tekken Kangaroo for us. We need to stock up on our crowd controls. I won't bother with Kunio Kun. I don't think there's really a point to that. Then again, he could do some sniping damage on the uh, Tekken Kangaroos, who should hopefully give us quite a bit of money for some kills here. Yeah, look at that. Uh, we have a Metal Rhino, which is a bit spooky, but I would rather have that than a Seal, I think. I think the Steel, the Seal is more deadly, isn't it? So, so far, not too bad. Yeah, he's, everyone is just out of reach of that guy. And then any uh, goons that try to get through, Kenneth's uh, Surge will be able to keep him at bay. I think, yeah, bringing Kenna was just such a great choice. Rhino's coming in, pushing forward. We need to get some freezes on him or even a crit. He's actually causing some big damage right now. That's actually super spooky. Need to make sure that we... I don't know. I can't really see her. That's the thing. There's so much going on. But I'm just hoping the uh, waitress cat is still alive. Oh, there we go. Rhino's dead. Even the big guy's dead as well. With those guys there, and we're just left with him. I think that's a GG. I think, yeah, that was quite easy. That really wasn't that bad. Thank God that... Oh! Oh, fuck! I used my thing. Check. Chat, I didn't know he was here. Oh my god! There was an assassin bear here? What happened there? Oh my Phew. god, there was an assassin bear. It's a very weak assassin bear. Only 100%, I think. I thought that was... I, I saw, like, my life flash before my eyes there. All right, there we go. Drop reward earned. Rare cat. Hoop kit. True form received. Unlock it after reaching level 20. Here we go. Show off cat. So we've gone from a little cute little goon into a taller goon who's a bit of a show off. What now? Is he gonna be eating the hoop? Is he gonna become the hoop? Is he literally the hoop cat? <laughs> hoop master cat. Oh. Oh, it's just more rings. He's like the exact same goon. It's just more rings. But uh, hey, I guess uh, his qualities are gonna make up for it. Oh, wait, no, he does go a bit tall there. Uh, hoop master cat. He's out of control and just can't get enough of those lovely hoops. Will the spinning ever stop? Has a chance to freeze metal enemies. Nice. There we go. It's done. Introducing Hoopmaster, Bane of Metal. So you know how I said he had a decent range, 20% freeze chance for two seconds in the second form. Now scratch that, true form buffs his range from 190 to 215, making him guaranteed to outrange any common metal enemy and also buffs his freeze from 20% 2 seconds to 40% for 4 seconds. Truly really the best mental crowd control in the game. Better than Poisoned on, dare I say. You better not say that when um, when the agent is around, otherwise you're going to make him upset. I'll quickly uh, finish up the prediction. Are we feeling up for some hula hooping? Congratulations to the believers, you win. We, le we leave off on a, on a positive on uh, Believers. That was nice. Lots of good progress there. To be fair, like, we've really buffed the hell out of the, um, the anti-metal, which I really needed because, again, the Enigma stages I was doing for metal were just bad. They were really rough. Uh, so now that should hopefully be a lot easier. Have a good day wherever you are, and I'll see you next time. Bye-bye! Yes!